Aloha and welcome to our channel. You are watching Holo Holo Adventures. I was on vacation when I filmed this video and I was in vacation in Oahu, Hawaii. I went shopping to the NEX and commissary. I'm going to show you all what we looked at and what I did pick up at the end. This video is part of a grocery haul collab. I want to thank Tiffany from Small Town 6 and I also wanted to thank Jessica Myros. They do this collab once a month and I love participating in it. If you are interested in joining their grocery haul collab in the future, definitely DM them on Instagram and join this fun collab. Now you might be wondering, Roxy, you're not just doing a grocery haul. Yes, I'm not just doing a grocery haul. I love to show you all what I see. So I'm also showing you all a shop with me. And I figured I'd give you a taste of shopping here in Hawaii. The NEX or Navy Exchange has a lot of grocery items. And so I'm showing you all here some of the grocery items that I'm planning on picking up. Obviously, I'm on vacation in this video, so I'm picking up things that I can take back home to Texas. This is a must item for my family. It is your Lihi Moi goodies. We love our dried mangoes. We love our gummy candies sprinkled with some lihi moi. This is the Hawaii style snacks. If you are ever on vacation, you have to try these. If you are a big snacker, whether you like sweet or salty or both, you can definitely find it in some of these fun Hawaii snacks. Kyra's favorite is the lihi moi dried mango. My favorite is the Lihi Moi Lemon Peel Gummy Candies. Now I included the NEX or Navy Exchange into this grocery haul video only because when you are stationed at any of the bases, a lot of times you'll have an exchange slash commissary. They're two separate, but they're normally near each other. So most service members and their family would shop between um, uh, an exchange like this, as well as a commissary. And sometimes prices wise, they can be cheaper here at the exchange compared to the commissary. So ideally the exchange and the commissary go hand in hand. One of the best things that you have to pick up if you are ever vacationing here in Hawaii is Hawaiian coffee. I love a variety of Hawaiian coffee, but one of my favorites is the Lion's coffee. It is 100% Kona coffee. They can get really pricey, so when you do see the word 100%, you know you're paying over 10, 12, 15 dollars or even more for good quality 100% coffee. And if you don't wanna spend that kind of money to get 10% Kona coffee and spend about $10 or less for it, it is still worth getting one bag to bring home. I saw this water bottle and I immediately thought of Mia and I had to get it at $22.99 with all of these cute little images of the pineapple, noodles, musubi, shave ice. I needed to get it so I got a pink one for Mia.
Don't forget that this video is part of a collab and there is a link under the description box. Please check out the other ladies and all the goodies that they got on their recent grocery haul. One of the last things I needed to pick up before I left Hawaii was all of the University of Hawaii goodies. I got shirts for my girls, I got a lanyard, and I also got stickers for our water. This is a great way for me to represent Hawaii as well as the school I graduated from. I wanted to show you all firsthand some of the prices here in Hawaii. Food in general is expensive right now all over the world. But in Hawaii, it's just crazily inflated compared to Texas. So as you can see, tomatoes, they are $2.19 for this bundle. Per pound, if you saw it earlier, it was four, over $4 for tomatoes. And when my husband got a good amount of tomatoes, which you'll see, because he was making salsa for the family, he spent $18 on all that tomato. It's pretty crazy. Look at that pineapple, $1.09 a pound. And you could have easily spent, I don't know, a couple dollars for sure, maybe $5 or $6 for this pineapple, maybe even more because that's a whole pineapple, you know? Papaya, $1.49 a pound. You could easily, with how heavy this papaya can be, definitely $5 for one, for one. But how often do you see beautiful papayas like that too, you know? I wanted to show you this right here. This is Poi. Poi, if you don't know, is taro. And it's a very um, popular food item here in Hawaii. It is a main staple. So when you go to a luau, you'll normally see poi. This is corned beef. It is Australian corned beef. It is one of my favorites. It's actually very expensive, and I don't know if I've seen it anywhere else, so I did pick one up. Here are some of the prices on yogurt, cottage cheese, sour cream. They are definitely more expensive than what I'm used to. These are the cheeses. Obviously the Freedom brand, which is a commissary brand, is priced better compared to your crafts. But still yet, I mean, look at those prices. They're definitely a dollar different from what I'm paying at HEB. I did find something unique here. It is honey costella cake and a green tea roll cake. These I haven't seen before at the commissary, so I thought that was pretty cool seeing it here. This is a real life haul of someone who is from Hawaii that is taking goodies back home to Texas. So first I'm going to show you all is this right here. This is my daughter's ube bread that she loves and she can really whack this in like a couple days. So I'm taking that. I also got one big thing of pandisa and there are big sizes. So we love this, but we'll just probably put it in the freezer and we are ready to eat it. I mean, well, we'll just grab as needed. This is the Lintelok, another Filipino, Filipino bread item. Obviously, we love our Filipino goodies. Okay, this one is your nori. So this nori I have not found or seaweed. I found in Texas like this exact brand and so I'm getting this one out. I am getting some candies. Very easy leaky mold. It's like a candy with the plum inside. So pick this up. I am getting some gummies. I have to get my lemon peel gummies. I got mango floor for Kyra because she loves me. Thank you. 
had seen it in Texas, but I wasn't sure, so I just did get one can. But this with some cabbage, delicious with rice. Amazing. Okay, you all what I've seen. Okay, this is a beauty. Look at that. You got noodles. It's by Musubi. Shave ice, pineapple, all the Hawaii goods. So that's going home. Either for kind of idea. This one here is a furikake mochi popcorn mix. That was from my sister. For a kake popcorn mix again. Um, got some stuff. That's from home. Got a blank, not blanket, but um, a really cute beach towel. Another cute beach towel. This one here. Again, so, let me show you this one. See, you all have probably recognized this when I had bought it um, at the commissary. I'd love to get that one. And that is it. That is it. So, lots of goodies from Hawaii. We had to get them because, I mean, it's all the goods. You just need to get them. Hope you all enjoyed this video. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Mahalo!